السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس ویلکم ٹو اوور ٹوڈیز میتھس کلاس چیپٹر نمبر فور پروبیبلٹی پارٹ ٹو آف کلاس نائن ان دا پریویس ویڈیو اسٹوڈنٹس وی ہیو ڈسکس دا انٹروڈکشن آف پروبیبلٹی واٹ از پروبیبلٹی اینڈ واٹ آر دا آؤٹ کمس اینڈ واٹ آر ایکولی لائکلی آؤٹ کمس اینڈ واٹ آر پاسبل آؤٹ کمس امپاسبل آؤٹ کمس آل دوز تھنگس وی ہیو ڈسکسڈ ان اوور earlier videos today i am going to start the exercise of this probability chapter so let us see the first question of exercise 14.1 see the question students open page number 307 and see here a dice has six faces numbered from 1 to 6 it is rolled and the number of The number on the top face is noted when this is treated as a random trial. Here we have to take one die and on that dice the numbers are from 1 to 6. You all know what is die and on the dice the numbers are from 1 to 6 only and it is rolled. Here we are rolling the die students. It is rolled and number on the top face is noted. what is the number on the top face those are noted and uh, when this is treated as a random trial when it is treated as random trial we have to answer these three questions what is the first question what are the possible outcomes nothing but you have to say what are the possible outcomes next are they equally likely and why they are equally likely and why they are equally likely that also we have to say and find the probability of a composite number turning up on the top face here you have to find the probability of composite number what is a composite number students do you know what is composite number so composite numbers are those numbers which have more than two factors if a number contains more than two factors then we say them as composite numbers these composite numbers let us do the solution of this one first one so this is the solution of 14.1 first one students so what is this a dice contains six faces we all know a die contains six faces and those faces are like this it is one and two dots three dots next four dots will be there five dots and lastly six dots will be there like this so here these are the outcomes and first one you have to write possible outcomes nothing but how many outcomes are possible that we have to write how many are possible students one is possible yes one is possible this two can also be possible in random so write two this three also can be possible so write three four is also possible so right 4 5 is also possible similarly 6 is also possible hence i am writing possible outcomes are 1 2 3 4 5 6 like that you have to write this these are the possible outcomes next what is the second question are they equally likely here we have to say whether they are equally likely yes they are equally likely why they are equally likely with that also we have to say students why they are equally likely nothing but here at the same time one can come or six also is possible so hence out of these six uh, any number can be come on the top of the dice when we roll the die so chances of getting one is also same out of 6 1 can become only one time chances of getting 2 is also same that is out of all these 6 2 will come only one time similarly 3 will come one time 4 will come only one time 5 will come only one time 6 can also come only one time nothing but in one roll all these are equally possible outcomes chances of getting all them are equal that is only one hence we are saying yes they are equally likely yes these outcomes that is 1 2 3 4 5 6 are equally likely next let us see third question so see here students third question is of composite numbers 
सो हियर आई एम टेकिंग वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स द पॉसिबल आउटकम इन दिस आई हैव ड्रॉन ए स्मॉल लाइन फॉर फोर एंड सिक्स नथिंग बट वी आर अंडरलाइनिंग फोर एंड सिक्स वाई फोर एंड सिक्स स्टूडेंट्स हियर आउट ऑफ दीज सिक्स फोर एंड सिक्स आर कॉम्पोजिट नंबर्स नथिंग बट फैक्टर्स ऑफ फोर आर वन टू फोर एंड फैक्टर्स ऑफ सिक्स आर वन टू थ्री सिक्स लाइक दैट मोर दैन टू फैक्टर्स विल बी देर फॉर फोर एंड सिक्स हेंस वी आर टेकिंग फोर सिक्स देर फोर here we have to find the probability what is the definition of probability students it is p of c is equals to number of favorable outcomes by total number of outcomes here you have to write number of favorable outcomes by total number of outcomes so here the favorable outcomes are only 2 nothing but 4 and 6 are having more than two factors hence we are taking 2 that is you have to count like this this is one event and this is second event so 1 2 so take 2 by total number of outcome students here total outcomes are 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 if you count like this also these are 6 only so total number of outcomes 6 so 2 by 6 is equals to 1 by 3 how this 1 by 3 is coming 2 ones are and 2 threes are cancel by two table It is two ones are two threes are hence one by three. Therefore, the probability of composite numbers in a dice is one by three. Nothing but out of three outcomes, one is a composite number. Like this also, you can understand this. This is the probability. Remember the definition of probability. Next, see the second question, students. We have done the solution for first one. A coin is tossed hundred times, and the following outcomes are recorded. Here, a coin is there. That coin is tossed hundred times, and these two are the outcomes. That is, head is forty-five times, and tail we have got fifty-five times from the experiment. So here we have to compute the probability of each outcomes and find the sum of probabilities of all all outcomes. so let us find what is the probability of head and what is the probability of tail and sum of probabilities so this is the solution of second one students total outcomes are given 100 in that 100 head are 45 and tail are 55 let us find what is the probability of head and what is the probability of tail probability of head that is equals to number of favorable outcomes by total outcomes this is the formula of probability that you have to write and here favorable outcomes are how many students 45 so write 45 by total outcomes are given 100 so write 100 similarly we can write the probability of tail that is to tail favorable outcomes are 55 so write 55 by total are 100 like that you have to write the probability next let us find in this second one second question is sum of probabilities you have to do here i am doing probability of head plus probability of tail that is equals to 45 by 100 plus 55 by 100 nothing but here we have got probability of head 45 by 100 and probability of tail 55 by 100 students so write 45 by 100 plus 55 by 100 these two are like fractions so take 100 as it is add 45 plus 55 45 plus 55 is again 100 100 by 100 is 1 nothing but sum of probabilities is 1 whenever you do sum of probabilities you will get 1 this is the solution of second one of exercise 14.1 your today's homework is students this third one fourth one and fifth one do the homework and send it in your groups it is of spinner and these are of marbles and it is of english alphabets so today's section is over students do your homework and send it in your groups do it compulsorily